What's up guys? This is Matt Watson coming to you from Perth, Australia, where I've been partaking in Fringe World for the last month. And today I wanted to show you some of the crowd work and fun interactions that's happened between me and the audiences that I performed for. Enjoy. What's comedy? What? You got some comedy? Huh? You want a comedy? It's Matt! What's in comedy? Uh oh, the job is sort of just talking to you guys, and maybe our comics coming up here can uh, tailor their material to a little bit. Donna, you brought you brought all these lovely people, right? These five people right here. I could tell when you brought them in, you were so adamant. You put little reserve signs on the front row, like anybody that's ever been to a comedy show really wanted to sit in the front row. <laughs> but uh, that's what I like in a front row is uh, five people who really wish they weren't sitting there. So that's. <laughs> That's a good vibe to have going throughout the crowd. Really appreciate that. We were waiting on 16 people, and I realized 16 of you showed up. I'm not, you don't have to put your hands up, you're half the crowd. <laughs> How do you guys all know each other? What? All from work, what do you, what do you guys do? Finance. Finance, is that the final answer? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Very cool. Well, that, that's, that doesn't sound exciting at all, so I'm going to move on. <laughs> but, Nonetheless, I appreciate you guys showing up. Can we give these lovely 60 people whatever finances they're doing? Whatever finances they're doing, it certainly isn't done on time, but by God, they are here, and that is wonderful. How'd you guys meet? Uh, through work. Through work? Okay. Uh, good thing they're finance and not uh, HR back there. That would have been, would have been not so good. What, what were you working, sir? Uh, in the mines. In, in the mines? You found a diamond right there, but <laughs> I don't understand how you meet a woman in the mines. Are you, are you, also, are you, are you a mine worker? Kind of. Kind of? What were you, had you fallen down the mine? What year is it? You still, you still just like tumble into wells and then, and then this gentleman just comes by and is like, oh, some, some lovely lass has tumbled her way to the bottom of this pit. I must rescue her. What, uh, where do you work? How, how, do you, how are you involved with mines? I'm in the HR. You're in the HR. <laughs> That's how you end up dating them. You, you can break all the rules. I don't know what's going on with, with this lovely foursome. You guys. We're, we're celebrating Christmas. You're celebrating Christmas. Okay, all right. Um, you two, uh, you don't look like you're celebrating Christmas, but you do look like you live in a van together. So that's. <laughs> are you with any of these lovely gentlemen? I mean, no. Well, currently with them, you're right. Very, very good answer. I, this, this crowd is also a little cheeky, too. I like that. <laughs> Uh, how about um, in anything romantically beyond uh, Born into the same family. You guys are all siblings? Yeah. Wow, I'm sorry I insinuated that there was any sort of sexual <laughs> <laughs> activity going on with you and the band boys over here. So. <laughs> That's really cute. So you guys, uh, is this the whole crew or you, is there one sibling that you don't like so much? And... <laughs> You left, left them back in the van, yeah, windows up. In the Perth heat, that guy's dead right now. He's not gonna make it. You guys in your friggin' heat, dude. I swear to God, Perth feels like, you know that scene in Toy Story where Sid holds the magnifying glass up to Woody's head? It's just that all the time. Good energy, man. That's awesome. It's an absolute pleasure performing at uh, what looks like a uh, closed down mini putt course. <laughs> it's a uh, real honor to be in this alleyway with you guys. So. Uh, Career is on fire. So, are you? Do you have like a bet going on online, or are you, or are you taping? You're taping. Are you doing a story of me? Yeah, yeah. I was gonna, you know, put on the story. It's, 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 it's gonna have a real awkward ending on it right now. Just calling call it out. I love how you completely gave up on it now. You're like, oh, that story. You lost your chance with my 13 friends. That I haven't heard Facebook in years. You lost your chance with my 13 friends that I have on Facebook. Which is actually quite a lot. That's more than I have. So you know what? I probably pull that phone back out. So I really need, really need the hype. They've been friends for a year. Who the fuck you're gonna post? And they're like, yeah, we were with you. <laughs> Who are you trying to show this to? <laughs> yeah, I'm sitting beside you. I'm not gonna like it. I'm right here. Come. Hey you beautiful person, thank you so much for checking out this video. If you liked it, why not give it a wee thumbs up, throw the channel a sub, and send it to a friend. This week I'm performing my one-man show, Van Lord, here in Perth. And uh, being that's the case, I decided to pamper myself a little bit 
and uh, put myself up in this sweet hotel. And because of that, next week, I'm gonna teach you how if you're staying in a place with a buffet breakfast, you don't need to spend another dollar on food for the rest of the day. Shout out to my sponsor, Super Sparrow. If you guys need a water bottle of any kind with a lifetime guarantee, check out supersparrow.com for these awesome stainless steel guys and a variety of others. Use code MATT25 at checkout for 25% off your entire order. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you next week.